Hello everyone and happy Labor Day. I hope you are finding some relaxation in your long weekend. Um, we are opening up Flying With Air today. It is a subscription box that is brand new to me with such a cool story. It is created um, by a survivor of human, human trafficking um, and she found healing in the bohemian lifestyle. So she has taken that passion for the healing that she found in that lifestyle, that community, and translated it to a subscription box. There are a couple of different options. There's a wellness box, which is what I'm going to show you today, a wellness and fashion box, which has fashion items in it as well, and then there was a boho bag purse box, I believe. Um, don't quote me on that, but the box that I am showing you is the wellness box. Um, and this one runs $37.50 a month. Of course, I will link you down below. So if you're interested, you can go check her and her website and her business out. Um, and then you can see the prices of the other box on there as well. Um, so it came in a box. This box went on a journey. It was not flying with Eris' fault. It was sure my fault. I, um, I paid for the shipping on this box and I used my Apple Pay. And apparently my Apple Pay has an address from three years ago on there. So, And I still own that house. I have tenants in it. So she got it. She was like, this came for you. It's the first piece of mail in three years. It's probably gone there. Um, forwarded it to me. And then, and then my mailman shoved this box into a mailbox that is not this big. Like the whole front of it opens. So when you put it in there, mail person, who knows? Um, when they put it in there, it looked like it fit, but then when they closed the door on it, the the lips of the doors of the mail box um, were, it wasn't big enough to get this out. So I had to like wiggle it out like this the whole time. And then finally, um, some guy in his car who watched me show, it was also like 115 degrees. It wasn't, it was, it was 102. So I'm not exaggerating by that much, but um, I was wiggling it out and finally some guy was like, do you need help? Because I've been watching you struggle for a long time and I was like, don't talk to strangers, but yes, please. So he came over and used like the sheer force of all of his body weight to get it out. But the box held up beautifully. What a sturdy box. As you can see, um, at Flying With Air shop on Instagram right there, that is the uh, social media. On the front here, my name is printed with along with a butterfly illustration. And I'm so excited to get this open and see what's in here. Um, one of the things you can do is you can pick one or two items that go in your box um, from the shop so that you have, so you are, you make sure that you get a, a couple things that you like. Um, I was like, please surprise me with everything. I love surprises, so um, that is what they did for me. So Flying With Air Bohemian Box, created by a survivor. Uh, monthly subscription boxes always get discounts and free shipping. Um, so that is their website and their social media at the bottom. When you open it up, it looks like this. We'll see what these cards... As soon as I opened this, everything started to smell amazing in here. Um, so, hello and thank you for your order. Your box was, cre was curated with the earth in mind by using biodegradable and recycled materials whenever achievable. Awesome. Love that. Okay. And so the next thing in here, flying with air, ways to explore flying with air. Um, did you know we also teach online and in-person classes? So it looks like there are some classes offered. And then we provide self-care gifts and kits for family, coworkers, and friends all year long. So again, there is their social media and website information. I will tag it down below just so I, oh, as I always do. I'm going to open up the tissue paper and get right in. Took a layer of tissue paper off the top and it looks like this. So as you can see, there are um, bath and self-care products. And um, while the box is on a little, you know, it's like a, a, a mid-priced box, $37.50, um, there's a lot of stuff in here. Um, I told them that I love candles, and she told me that they don't make candles except for, like, tea lights. But she told me she would include a few tea lights as a treat. These are awesome for the bath because they fit in the bathtub, um, and, or like, on the ledge of the bathtub. Um, and they smell incredible. So I'll show you these. They are a variety of purple colors. There are four of them in here. Um, that's a repeat of the first. And then this last one is a white one. Smells like a fresh and clean, um, like a soapy scent, like a fresh soap scent. 
All right, so those are my tea light candles that I requested. So thank you so much for sending those. We'll get on to the goods. So these look like bath bombs. First three things I see in here. There is a heart-shaped purple one. It's, um, ooh, yeah, these smell so good. Bath bombs always smell so good. Um, I love bath bombs that are, like, sized like this because when you get the huge ones that are shaped like really fun things, that's, that's awesome, right? But they're typically pretty expensive and... I know that you can cut them, um, but I often do not. So using like the, the big, the huge designed ones, you gotta throw them in the bath and then they're done with. Um, so I much prefer something a little bit smaller so I don't feel quite so wasteful because I don't like to cut up bath bombs. It's a mess and like I don't choose to spend my time on that. Um, so these are the perfect size. There's a heart, there is this um, pink, circular one they all smell a little bit different and then this white um traditional ball shaped bath bomb so there's those and then there are four more things in here let's see what this is in a jar this is not labeled i wonder if there is um anything to describe well I can certainly use my, my brain about it. Um, this looks like it's bath salts. And I'm sure if I went onto their website as well, I'd be able to find, yes, it is bath salts. So as you can see on the top, I'm spilling, I'm spilling it onto my computer. On the top there, there are a couple of rose petals um, keeping this in place, but um, I'm gonna try not to make a mess. Let me show you. But inside there are these, these beautiful purple Bath, small, bath salts that smell like lavender. They're so yummy. I'm off for the weekend, so I definitely will be using some of this bath stuff. Um, I'm trying to see. There's a label that I missed. There's not. Okay, so it comes in a mason jar that looks like this. Super cute on the outside. Next thing in here. There, There is more than... Here are, I missed these almost. They're incense sticks. Love incense sticks. Um, these will make, when you burn them, and if you've never done this before, if you, when you burn them, they like make the whole room smell super yummy. Um, this is a vial of what looks like a bath ad as well. I wish, the only thing I will say is I wish, and maybe there is and I'm just like missing it, but I wish there was something obvious to tell me what all of this stuff is and how to use it um, because I'm just assuming that it all goes, that it's all bath stuff um, and that very well could be right. But I will take a peek around their website and I will let you know what I uncover. Um, I've been really into, this might be a bar soap and I've been really, in, yeah it is, and I've been real into bar soaps lately. Had you asked me, oh look how pretty it is. Um, had you asked me a couple months ago, I would have told you that every bar soap I've ever gotten in a box, I've just like given away or um, it sat in a drawer for a really long time until I gave it away. Um, but I've been using them. I've been making a point when I get one in a box to put it directly in my shower and get good use out of it. And now I'm in love. I've figured out that you can shave your legs with bar soap and if you're using the right kind of bar soap, it comes out like super soft and it's just... I turned over a leaf when it came to um, came to using bar soap, so that one will go directly into my shower as well. There it is all of this is wrapped individually in tissue paper so that it stays um, so that it didn't break in transit. Okay, so this one is labeled. This is a fresh organic lavender massage oil, but best for helping relax and nourish the skin. Yeah, everybody loves a good massage oil. Oh, this one smells, um, it's not over, it's not an overpowering lavender smell. You can also always add oils to your bath as well to make your skin nice and soft. Um, so this will go to good use. And then the last thing in here, we will open it up. I kind of, I fear it did break. It did break. It is not their fault. It is the fault of my 
male person not doing their job correctly, um, but this must have broken when I was shimmying it out of, yeah, it's gonna make a, it's gonna make a big mess. Oh, this is so sad. Here, take a look, take a look at this. Um, so as you can see, this jar did break in the mail because it was shoved into my mailbox and it didn't fit properly. Um, so that is a huge bummer, um, but it's okay. It's just the glass is broken, not the product. So I can definitely, once I'm done recording, I can just put this into a baggie or something um, where I can still use the product, but this looks like it's a bath additive as well. It says, there is a label on here, but I'm trying not to make a huge mess. Um, oh, I'm trying to see it here. Let's see. Signature Herbal Blend for Holistic Health. Add desire amount to your bath, herbal tea, or create a tea. Tincture. Tincture? I always have trouble with that word. Um, anyway, I, I'm obviously distracted by the fact that it's broken. I've said it a thousand times, but I'll say it again. Not playing with Air's fault at all. Um, that is everything that came in my wellness box. Please, please go check them out. Um, I will tell you, I had the most pleasant experience interacting with them. Um, as I usually do, but some, some boxes do better than others. And it was just uh, very much a pleasure. Um, to touch base with Flying With Air, and I hope to continue to um, use products from them in the future. And I will let you guys know how using these goes once I get this big old mess out of my hand and I'm able to post the video. Um, I will talk to you all soon. Please, please enjoy the rest of your Labor Day. Stay safe, stay well. Have a good one. Bye.